That attic fan noise isn't going to be a problem, is it? Hopefully not. Actually, if anything, it's a good audio test for this GoPro because it's background noise. GoPro Hero Session, by the way, not the Hero 5 Session. Anyway, guys, so why? It's once again me, David DeFranco, from DavidDeFranco.com and the comforts of my deck out back in beautiful Strasburg, Pennsylvania. Check this out. So I'm currently in Seaside Heights while you're watching this video. Actually, I should stop saying stuff like that because by the time you watch this in the future, I'm home again, so it's kind of pointless to even make that point. Pointless to make a point. Yeah, I think I just canceled myself out. Anyway, I just wanted to make a random GoPro video for you guys just to give you a decent idea of the video quality and audio quality. I did this last week and overall I was very, very happy with the results. I think it looks great, especially considering this camera sells for $149. Keep in mind, it does not have stabilization of any kind. So that means if you're doing this, it's going to be shaky. But there are accessories you can buy to stabilize your footage. I think GoPro's official gimbal is like $200 or $300. Sorry, it's very windy. Um, and I don't think I'm willing to spend that much. However, with that said, I am willing to do some shopping around for third-party accessories. Like this little uh, floating mount I'm using right now, but I'm more interested in finding a third-party gimbal. Maybe one that sells for $100. Alright, so anyway, let's go inside. The real point behind today's video is to do a water test. Because, as you may or may not know, and there's a little bit of confusion because I saw comments, this one girl I was like, David... Just to let you know, you need a case, like a housing, to make this Hero Session waterproof. That is false. The Hero Session is waterproof by default up to 33 feet below. And I think that is just awesome, awesome in itself. So let's test it. I have not put this in water yet. I'm going to turn the sink on. Oh, God. Good luck. God, I hate doing this. It really does make me nervous. Good luck. <laughs> Ooh. I know, I know it's waterproof, but I don't like putting it underwater. It freaks me out. Let's get that housing clean. It's still working. That's good, right? But the real test is when I take this in the ocean in salt water. I wonder how that's going to behave with the speaker because the speaker, well, sorry, the microphone is exposed, but obviously GoPro was smart about it. It's technically within a uh, waterproof housing enclosure, whatever you want to call it. But I'm a little nervous to take it in salt water. But maybe I shouldn't be nervous because that's why people use these GoPros, right? To take it surfing and, and sailing and boating and kayaking. Because, you know, I do all that stuff. Not really, but if anything, I might buy a new boogie board. That's it. That's all I wanted to do in this video. I wanted to submerge this in running sink water, uh, but I will be taking it deeper when I actually go to Seaside Heights. So I will definitely be taking this eight feet below in the pool at Lunamara Motel. Awesome motel if you're looking for um, reasonable pricing, cleaned rooms, amazing staff, free breakfast every morning, pizza on, I think, Wednesdays or Thursdays? I always forget. I think it's Thursday now. Okay, this is like turning into an ad for Lunamar Motel. You know what? I'm going to link them right below. They've been very great to us, and I've actually had viewers stay there because of my family. And I think that's so awesome that I can actually give them additional business. Hey, 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 hey. So, on that note, guys, check them out right below. I think you'll like them. And I will see you in my next video. And stay tuned for Seaside Heights 2017. That's coming very soon.